It's a new way to stock up. In just 90 minutes, your weekly shop is delivered to your front door. G'day. Here's your groceries. Mother of three, Linda Kinos, dreads going to the supermarket. Getting them all into the car and walking down the aisles without one screaming, wanting one thing and one wanting the other, it just takes, I guess, the misery out of supermarket shopping. Grocery Butler is the latest entry into the multi-billion dollar online market. With just a click of a button, a personal shopper delivers your groceries in around an hour. It's quite a unique service and something that Coles always don't do. Online retailer G2U believes it too can compete with the supermarket giants. Ours is all about service, service and quality produce. Online sales have doubled in the past five years to $2 billion. That's 2.2% of the lucrative grocery market. That figure is expected to rise even further over the next five years, with predictions consumers will buy $3.5 billion worth of groceries online by 2019. As online sales become more lucrative, supermarkets are definitely going to be paying attention to the amount of sales they're not getting. Online wine retailer Vino Mofo is taking away some of that market share. In three years, they've signed up 270,000 customers. So we just looked at what we thought Coles and Woolies didn't do well. We work directly with the best producers. Uh, we find the most awesome wines and we share them with our members. Vicky Jardim, Nine News.